What's up YouTube? It's so fun from TechCycle. In this video, I am going to share you guys a way to install Kali NetTender on your Android phone. Also, this is going to be a magic module. So, let us begin. So, talking about this Kali NetTender. It is an overlay package for your custom ROM or your stock ROM. This is a package which will, which will install Kali Linux on your Android phone. It is not as powerful as it is of computer but you can use most of the package which is come with Linux. You can install most of the package and you can use it on your Android phone. Talking about this, Kali NetTender is only available for particular devices such as all OnePlus device, Samsung device and the Nexus devices. So there are lot of developers who are porting this ROM for most of the devices but it is not as successful as it is. As they are working for some devices it is very successful. The Kali NetTender package we are installing today is ported by Atari from XDA. Sorry about the pronunciation of his name. This is a magic module as I stated at the first. This is going to be an easy installation and there is a lot of advantage and some bugs regarding this which I will talk at the end of this video. So without further ado, just jump into the installation tutorial. Also before that jumping, we are going to do the disclaimer alert. This video is only for educational purpose. I will not be responsible for anything happen to your device. So let's begin. So on your Android, head over to the link given in the description. It is the XDA forum link and download the uh, Magisk module. I have already downloaded that and I have already installed that too. So it's going to be an overview of how I did I how I did this. So Open our Magisk Manager, this is the latest version. So add our to modules and choose this plus icon and just navigate to the download file. After that, just open the file. Long press the file and choose open. It will install this Magisk module and restart your device. So after installing that Magisk module, you will have three application that is three net under application that is net under net under terminal and net under vnc viewer so open the net under app and in the left side choose kali ch root manager and to the, the here you will have the option to install ch root choose that and choose install full you need to install full ch root of this Kali so I have faced a lot of bugs which I will talk at the end of this video which is I will talk after this screen recording I have already faced some issue while flashing the magic module 2 which I will also talk at the end of this screenshot record so after installing that you will be need to restart your device and you will have this interface so here you can find a lot of options these are some Kali NetTender options you cannot have all these app installed like this CS Pro or the like this USB keyboard and you know this RF analyzer, router keygen, short and these are not installed as default. You need to install it separately. So it is very easy to install. So this is how you install Kali NetTender. It is a very easy process and you can achieve that. So the bugs I found are while installing Magisk module, if you are having an issue like the NetTender app, NetTender terminal, NetTender VNC is not installed, you need to extract the zip file and install it manually. That is the first bug. And the second bug is while installing the ch root package. So, so if you have not faced any issue, you are good to go but if you have faced issue like you cannot download it from online it is going to download about 900 gb 900 mb of 
file and it's going to end up with an error of server error which i faced so i use the second option that is downloaded it downloaded the ch root file from the netrunner page which i will leave the link in the description you can download it from there and i pasted that file into the root explorer and renamed that file and use the option to flash it from the sd card which again end up in an error for me the error was like i cannot install it completely that is the error is i cannot install it completely which i faced in the terminal menu the terminal menu just force close itself and i cannot install it so i have faced the error again so the ish the fix for that is Download the file given in the Android file host. Link will be in the description. That is the CH root full menu. Just flash it from the TWRP recovery menu. So after flashing that, your CH root will be installed completely and you can use your Kali Netrunner package. The advantage of using this magic module is that you can uninstall it very fast and if you are you can install it without Modifying the system partition also you can bypass the safety net the disadvantages of using this is not a complete disadvantage because if you got a working kernel for Which is camp which is compatible with this Kali net under you can use every feature that is HID attack and using external Wi-Fi card so if you don't have an compatible kernel you cannot use HID attack you cannot use external Wi-Fi card and all sort of tools which require an external Kali enabled kernel so that's all about this Kali Netrunner and some bugs which I found for myself and I fixed and if you got any doubt or if you are facing an issue you can comment down below or you can add out to the forum I will leave the link in the description thanks for watching guys if you like this video hit the like button if you think this video sucks the dislike button and let me know so i can improve my contents and if you got suggestion for any other videos like this or anything else just comment down below or you can do that on twitter facebook or google plus link will be in the description and don't forget to subscribe